okay, it's 7 o'clock and I still feel like I could go to sleep. I did not sleep well last night. But, I went out in the world. Not in my car, though. My car... Kitty, kitty. Hi. Um... Like I said, I was getting two new tires put on my car, and we took it down early this morning. And about 11 o'clock they called. They broke the stud off one of my tires. So they had to call all around to find... They want to replace all five studs. Since one's weak, they want to replace them all to make sure they're all good. Here she comes. Come on, jump over here. Um... They called all around and they finally found one stud at one store and they're trying to find four more because once they have everything off they need to, to get off of there, they have, he said, we might as well, since everything's apart, we might as well do them all. I think studs only cost like $2 or so much cents each. So, they're on the hunt to look for studs for my car. And when Dad got off the phone, I was getting everything ready. He goes, you're not getting your car. Who's calling? I'll turn the ringer down a little. I have, I have no idea who that is. I don't know. It's a mystery. But anyway, I said, I can't get my car. I said, we are going out in the world. We'll take your car, and I'm driving. <laughs> so, we uh, get in Dad's car, and we had to go step at the bank, make a deposit, go to the post office, had to buy some stuff. Call back, and have my phone out in the vehicle. Um, it's my cousin Bart. He sounds like a frog when he talks because he's smoked so much in his life that he just sounds like a frog now. Um, he's always had one of those kind of voices. But um, I had to get a couple rolls of stamps because I was about out of stamps. And then we stopped by the garage because Dad had left his wallet and his phone in the glove box of my car. So we picked up that. And then we went to Martin's and had lunch. We had paninis for lunch. And um, I bought some cherries. They had cherries on sale there for $1.99 a pound. So I got a bag of cherries. I got me a muffin. Uh, what else did I get there? I didn't buy much at... Oh, and a thing of steaks. Three little steaks that they had as a special this week. It was like $3.62 for like these three sticks, which I wrapped up in more plastic and put in the freezer for some time when Dad and I want steak. It'd be the, it's a perfect amount for both of us, so. I think that's all I bought. And then we went to Myers, and I had some coupons I wanted to use. I had to get new body wash, which was right. Yeah. I like the Olay body wash. And at first I'm like, oh my god, they don't have any more. They changed containers. Now it looks like this because it didn't look like this. Because like scanning, like, where's my, where's my thing at? And then, so then I really had to look. Um, I got like four and a half pounds of green beans, which I think I'm going to go in and snap those here in a minute. And then, oh, but I didn't have Dad bring in that pot. I could snap them and put them in something, I suppose. I'll figure that out. Uh, I bought some plums. I wanted to get some nectarines, but they were hard like rocks. I looked at the peaches, they were hard like rocks. But I went and checked out the plums, which I very rarely ever do, and they were nice and soft and tender. I'm like, the plums won. Yes, they did. Uh, Got some chicken breasts for the freezer because we I have eaten all the chicken breasts in our in the freezer. And I had a coupon for some Magnum ice cream bars. I got a couple boxes of those for the freezer. I had a coupon for some yogurt. I got me six things of yogurt. I got a couple boxes of cereal. A couple cans of spaghettios. Dad bought toilet paper. Isn't that exciting? Um, so that's pretty much what we did. Uh, then I got home and did some work, a little bit of work. 
because we went and got mail at the post office, so I got a deposit ready for tomorrow already. Um, paid a couple bills that we got in the mail. We have to get a new radiator for one of our trucks because the radiator blew yesterday. But my cousin was here. He gets a call. Our driver's like, dude, I don't, I think the radiator blew. So that's joyous. That's going to be like $400 for a new radiator. Um, now I've just been sitting here at the computer doing a whole lot of nothing. Oh, I've been looking up some stuff. Watching a few videos. I'm going to have to take some leave though. I'm starting to get a headache. And this light shining in my face really isn't helping any. So I'm going to take some leave and snap green beans. Or I could snap green beans tomorrow and watch some stuff on the DVR. I don't know. I have choices. And somebody told me, a couple people told me that that book that I was mad how it ended, there will be another one, but it doesn't come out until December. Because it was called, the other one was called Here, and that one's going to be called There. So I have a long wait. I'll probably forget all about that book by December. <laughs> That's a long time. Dang it. I'm still trudging through the one about the people who bought the lodge on the island. Um, their first winter on the island was not nice. It was the worst winter in like 50 years that they'd had. And so this woman's husband was not particularly happy. Um, I'm going to try to finish it tonight because I'm about, I'm almost to the... I think I'm like 75% done with it, so I, I should finish it up tonight. See what happens. Um, maybe every once in a while I'll tell you guys a book I'm reading. Because, you know, as you all know, I read a lot. I do, I do. But now I really have to take some leave. And I think I have to empty the black top. So I hope you're having a good Thursday. I was happy to be out into the world. It was weird driving my dad's car because it sits a little bit lower than mine, so I felt like I was sitting in a hole. But at least I got out. It's all that mattered. So, goodbye!